it's time for more rain in Louisiana. So we're uh, here. We just cleaned up a mess that the dog left. Bad Pippi is bad. Although that is one big giant bone there. And we're here to find out more about the uh, voodoo-ness of our lady here. Ooh, detective. You smell like that garbage you've been picking up around here. If you've got a question to ask me, you best be quick about it. <laughs> You're the one that made me do it. Voodoo. Like I said before, my beliefs are no concern of yours, Detective. If you have a hankering to find out about Voodoo, I suggest you find your way downtown and speak with someone named Mama Amy. Mommy Amy. She runs the store down the way. She should be open about now and she can answer any questions you might have. Okay, I guess I could do that. I do want to go over here though. Uh, because I need to figure out how to to do this. So. Play the piano. So we've got jesters. Alright, well this is going to take some time, so I'm going to kind of cut here. You guys can watch it in full speed, and then we'll see you in a split second. back because we figured out the puzzle. So let's go ahead and find out what's inside this piano. We got ourselves 9 out of 20 here. So it looks like we're going to be counting up. Ooh, creepy spider is creepy. Two, four. Um, does that work? Blended in here, holy cow. Oh, come on, that was barely even necessary. Frog, rabbit's foot, roach, and fan. A voodoo doll. What does a voodoo doll look like? That's not a brooch? No, that's not a brooch, that's a hair thing. Fly swatter, shrunken head. Ice water, shrunken head. So where's the shrunken head? Well, I thought that might have been a brooch, but I was wrong. A goblet, charcoal, and photograph. and a fan. Hmm. That doll looks super evil, my goodness. <laughs> what does a brooch look like? I have no idea. Uh, that's a voodoo doll? Okay, cool. I'll go with that. So we have a rabbit's foot, a brooch, and charcoal. So, a brooch and charcoal. There's charcoal. This is a rabbit's foot. Alright, we'll just go ahead and do the last one here. 
Eyeball. Interesting. I got rubbing paper and a charcoal. That's kind of interesting. What else is going on in here? Looks like Mama Amiya needs to restock items in the shelf. Of course she does. Welcome to Voodoo Absolute. Folks around these parts call me Mama Amy. Look like you got something on your mind, child. Come on in. Take a look around. Afraid I don't rightly know of any lost souls, child. The folks who moved in down the road best be moving on. Make no mistake, there's evil up there. I can tell by the look in your eyes, you've seen the face of evil. Mm -hmm. You are correct. I'm sure by now, someone has told you about the curse of the evil Mr. Crown. I'd be happy to tell you more, but I don't much care for charity. The rain has been keeping me from restocking my inventory. How about you go fetch me some items for my display here? You do that, and I may teach you a little voodoo. Ooh, let's learn some voodoo. All right, let's go voodoo things. Voodoo it up. Cool. Throw up in the ashtray here. Gross. This is totally the most gross thing ever. Uh, all right. Well, that does actually look familiar. I think that was over here. Or was it in here? Uh, oh, I don't think so. Where did I see that? <laughs> Mr. Checkers, I am not going to play checkers with you today. I'm going to play checkers with you at the absolute last moment in time. <laughs> He is a cheat. He's a cheater. Checker cheater. Darn snake. How am I supposed to get the snake eggs? I'm not sure if that's what that is. But... Ooh, where's the pretty rose? Ah. Cool. What else do we have here? Nope. I'll figure that fish thing out eventually. Don't I need anything here? No? Oh, but you know what? Can I not do this? Oh. Maybe not. It's murky water. Alright, I'm just trying. Just experimenting. Where's all this other stuffs? Hmm. Keep your hands off our property! Yeah, yeah, yeah. I know I've seen that skull somewhere. Where was it? The turtle shell, too. No, it wasn't down here, I don't think. Hmm. Um. Okay. Oh yeah, I forgot about this. Nothing here. Can't get to those gates, apparently. Other way, crap. I knew I saw it somewhere. Of course, that doesn't help me with everything else that I have on my list. supposed to do with this snake other than whack it with a pickaxe. 
<laughs> Such luck. It's gotta be something here. Yeah, but where did the parrot go? I don't have the parrot anymore. How am I supposed to get the parrot back? Ugh. Uh, I lost your parrot. Not now, that is time for my story. Why does he keep running away? Seriously, why does it keep it flying away from me? Why did I marry that man? I have no idea how to keep the parrot with me. Uh -huh. Ooh, that smells like Oh, that's lovely. Why? That's not good at all. What am I supposed to do? Trap it or something? Aha! Bird cage. Okay. How am I supposed to deal with this? Honey? Yeah, get in there and suck up that honey. Now I got myself a bird cage. Ha ha. Let's go. Hmm. It's yum yum honey time. Now I can go get myself a parrot. Now you're not getting away from me ever. You are trapped. There you go. Five, forty-five, twenty. Five, forty-five, twenty. What is this supposed to mean? Idea. Uh, hi, stranger. Something I can do for you, stranger? You're a stranger. I don't know nothing about it. Frankly, I don't care to. Okay. Don't tell me you came all the way down here to ask me such foolish questions. Do I look like I want to be bothered? The only ghost around here is going to be wearing your shoes if you don't leave me alone. Whoa. These aren't been dangerous. You sure did threaten me with a gun. Huh. He disappeared. Interesting. Okay, now we just need an egg. Go back this way. I don't know what this means. Oh boy. I've got some egg. What's this all about? Strange stones. I have no idea. Yeah, you're not the only one snooping around in the swamp. 
okay, so what do I got here? There, I replaced your shop. What kind of foot is that? Thank you for running that errand, detective. Why don't you take this as payment? What the heck is this? It's what I call a sleeping conjure. You put a little in someone's drink, and they will sleep fine for a short while. Is there anything else Mama Amy can do for you? Seems kind of random to me. Ooh. Just hearing that name makes my blood run cold. It's the man who built, and then rebuilt, the house down the way. I say rebuilt because he burned it. He burned it to the ground with the screams of his 13 crewmen inside. He didn't want them knowing where he'd hid the treasure. One skull each for every man who died in the fire. I suppose he wanted his crew with him long after he passed on. Find the skulls, and you find the treasure. <laughs> I reckon that nasty old Mr. Crown is keeping watch over what he don't want found. Thirteen skulls. Best be careful out there, detective. Snakes and gators aren't the only trouble in those waters. The only reason someone would be out there is because they want to be left alone. I'm afraid you'll have to tell that Mrs. Lawson that no one has seen nor heard from her missing husband. Fair enough, but uh, I don't know if that's going to be enough to make her stop, right? What do you mean no one's heard of my missing husband? I've posted signs around town and it's all over the paper. Marcus wouldn't have simply wandered off and left my daughter and I alone. It was his idea to move here in the first place. I'm sure those crazy locals had something to do with it. <laughs> the crazy locals? That crazy neighbor of ours. He fires his gun at anything that moves. How do I know he didn't attack Marcus? Have you met the lowlifes at that bar? That dive bar down by the, the river? Don't tell me that place isn't full of criminals. I'm beginning to wonder if that couple we hired isn't behind all this. Wow, everyone's suspicious in her eyes. There's something shady about them. I can't put my finger on it, but I've seen the way she looks at me. I thought we were doing them a favor by giving them jobs and letting them stay in the carriage house. I would appreciate it if you would quit running all these little errands and get to the bottom of things. Fair enough. Looks like that rain's here to stay this evening. How goes the investigation, detective? I don't like your tone. The dark magic is not something I recommend fooling with, detective. You best be keeping an eye out for uh, missing Mr. Lawson. And keep the other eye off me and my wife. That includes peeking around the corner where we're staying. That carriage house is going to stay locked. I told you everything I know, and you best be respecting our privacy. Well, I don't believe in ghosts, but that place makes me uneasy. Funny you ask, though. The only time I seen it open was the morning after Mr. Lawson disappeared. You can't be thinking that some ghost come out of his grave and went after him. Well, I never did actually unlock that gate, but I know where one of the keys is hiding. I suppose I could lend it to you, but I need you to help me with something first. All this rain is making these weeds grow faster than I can get rid of them. How about you grab a pair of them garden shears and clip all them weeds along the side of the house? Really? Really? He's gonna put me to work now, too? Wow. What the heck am I looking for here? Oh, these are weeds, are they? These are pretty flowers. Jeez, they keep coming back. Goodness. Oh, 
All right, that was your weeds. See what I mean about them weeds? It's like they got a mind of their yeah, own. I have to agree with that. Like key I was telling you about in a tin on a top shelf in the shed. If I was you, I'd be leaving that graveyard alone. But you're not me. I'm a detective. Ah, uh, the shed. It's this way, right? Hey, found you. Ten out of twenty. Triangle symbol key. So I'm not sure what I understand. How do I find my way to the graveyard? Oh, it's, it's, I gotta go back the other way. I think. I'll try it, anyways. This way. Wait, no, that's not it. Um. Yeah, here we are. Triangle. I don't even know what this even means. How do I get in here? Oh. Oops. Okay. We're totally doing this. What the heck? I don't understand. What am I missing? How do I even know how it goes? Really? This is kind of crazy. How am I supposed to know how to do this? Oh, I see. Yeah, that does actually seem to work. Aha! Uh -huh. Okay, hang on a second. Right there! Diamond Triangle. Wow, that's gonna take me a couple attempts here. Alright, hang on a second. Get these out of here. Okay, so let's see here. First order of business. Moon. Goes here. On a diagonal. Diamond. Goes here. Like that. Triangle. Stays like that. Star. Stays like that. Yay! Alright, well we're going to break here and we'll see you in the next episode when we dive into the graveyard. Well, not die. We head in. We head into the graveyard. There's no dying. Just moving in. We'll see you next time.